Hi everybody. This is my property in uh, the very back portion of it. Uh, I live in northwest Florida. And as you can see, it's kind of a, a damp area. We got cypress trees there and I've got the fence up for keeping my wife's pet pygmy goats in and keeping the predators out. <clears throat> but like in most places in Florida, we have got a wild pig problem. You can see on the other side of this uh, property line where the fence is, they have just chewed it up. I mean, it looks like an industrial rototiller went through there. And as far as you can see, everything's gone. They've just, everything's decimated. Any uh, wild flowers that would have been there for the, my bees to get a nectar on, uh, they're dead. So, a lot of people don't realize that uh, pigs are not indigenous to Florida. Ponce de Leon brought them over from Spain as a food source when he was looking for the Fountain of Youth. And they got loose and they have just caused havoc across the south part of the United States. And Texas has really got a problem. And there are no natural predators for these guys. And they are super aggressive. Now they've calmed down a lot from what they were when I first uh, caught them out here this morning. They were charging the fence and they would have loved to got at my legs. But um, the uh, trap is, uh, and I'm not taking credit for anything, I got everything off YouTube. Uh, individual showed everybody how to make the uh, guillotine door. Um, I made mine four foot wide to make it even, you know, easier for the pigs to get in without such a tight opening. The um, trigger is actually just a piece of wood with the rope attached in that rope and trigger gets wrapped around that post right there and it's simple but very ingenious and all that post uh, or I should say the bolt is sticking out the side that gets wrapped around then that post right there is propped up underneath that wood plate then you pile a bunch of corn underneath it and as they're rooting around they dislodge that um, piece of wood and it it just sets the trigger off and the trap door comes down and and there they are. So with that destruction over there you can see why farmers are so upset with these little creatures here. You know they're they're just doing what's in their nature to root. It's just that there's so many of them now. But um, I did give them water because I don't want them to suffer any more than they have to. And um, anyway so that uh, is going to be six less pigs out there destroying the environment for other creatures that are supposed to be here. So, I just wanted to share uh, this little video with my adventures in pig trapping. So far it's been su successful. Anyway, take care for now.